What's up, everybody? This is Colin from Holistic Heritage Homestead. I hope you're all well. Today, I am doing a review on Dear Femi's Weed Puller. I'm super excited. Dear Femi has been hitting a home run with their products so far. So I took the liberty to open this up already. And you folks already know, I open with a machete. It's fun. It's cool. It keeps me happy. Got this thing open and I got right into it. I did put it together because your time is valuable and so is mine. By the way, don't mind the sweat. The sweat is real and so is the review. I put this together in probably just a few minutes. So as far as putting it together, super, super easy, folks. What I like about Deer for me is they, they package everything nicely. Things come covered in plastic, covered in cardboard, so it's protected. I don't want something showing up with damage. I don't want things showing up broken. So that's really nice packaged well. I like that everything you need comes with Deer for me products, at least from what I've seen so far. A couple of Allen keys, some hardware, that's all you need. You do not need any tools to put this together. Just some elbow grease to make it happen, and that's it, folks. Um, very, very easy to put together. I will say it is, so far from what I've seen from their products, it's kind of instincts. You just look at it, you put it together, that's it. I did not look at the instructions much. It does come with instructions, so you do have all the information you need here. I will say, it did take me a few minutes. I did make a mistake when I put it together. So normally, um, with the other Deer Femira products, I would say I'd give them like a 9.5 to a 9.8 as far as ease to put together. I give this a 9.0. And arguably, that's because I'm not that good at putting things together. I still think this could be put together by most folks within three minutes or less, okay? Very, very cool. Nice looking thing here, all right? Very, very nice. It's got a little weight to it, but lightweight um, in the sense that this is not going to be something that's going to be difficult to carry around. It's strong. It's made of solid materials. Um, this business end of it over here looks pretty intense. Feels sturdy. Everything feels tight, secure, nothing loose. So seems like something that is sturdy. Let me talk to you folks about pulling weeds. Now, a lot of people are going to say, well... It's a weed puller. And I'm going to say, yes, it is a weed puller. But I'm also going to tell you, this is not just for weeding. This is for eating. Hear me out, folks. For those of you who are into foraging, you want to harvest some dandelions with the roots? Here you go. Lamb's quarters, whatever, nettles, whatever you want, this is going to be for you. For those of you who have been following our channel, we practice regenerative agriculture here. We practice soil remediation. We try to heal the property. So in most of our property, we do not pull weeds. However, there are times where you will want to pull weeds. One example is around your home, you do want what I would call a fire break, okay? What might be called a fire break. You want at least a few feet. I would say four to five feet minimum of well-manicured, flat, clear, and clean property. Just in case there's sparks, there's flame, there's fire, it's less likely to have fuel and then less likely to move to your home. That's just common safety, smart practice in general. So you might want to actually go around your home, around the perimeter of your home, and pull weeds before they go to seed. So then over time, you'll have less weeds. You'll probably have more manageable grass or other vegetation you could just mow, okay? There's that. There are times where I might want to pull weeds for foraging, like I mentioned before. There are times where I might want to pull weeds to simply clean up garden beds. There are times where I want to pull weeds to stop weeds from competing for nutrients with our annuals, our perennials, whatever. Sometimes it's nice to, um, we let our weeds grow, but we also like to maybe just take them out and remove them to see where our plants are. I like to know the zucchini is zucchini. I like to know the tomatoes are tomatoes. And I could tell um, from gardening for many years, I know what those plants are, but I like it to look clean. I like to be able to pick out where the plants are, harvest quickly without having to move weeds out of the way. It helps me keep an eye on the soil better. Um, so this is great. This can help you manage and control the weeds and have them where you want them and take them out where you do not want them. So this definitely has purpose. You also might want to pull some weeds to throw to your livestock, your chickens, for example. Let them have fun. Let them eat that and get some good nutrition. Um, so it definitely has purpose. Now what I'm going to do, folks, is I'm just going to give you a little demonstration and get right into how this thing works and how easy it is. I will say um, 
As I get older, I am excited about things that take pressure off my back and off my knees. And I like that you can pull weeds from a standing position. That is a huge benefit. And as you folks can see, I'm dirty. I'm out here doing homestead things. I live this life. I, I, this is what we do. Um, anything I can do to make the things I do easier is worth it. This is an investment, folks. Invest in your health. Health is wealth. Keep the pressure off your knees. Keep the pressure off your back. Sure, you want to bend over and pull some weeds. You got a two or three weeds. Not a problem. When you're pulling a lot of weeds, this is something you want. So that's a great gift idea too. And not just for the elderly, okay? Uh, I'm not elderly yet. But I'm on my way, and I'll tell you, um, I really do appreciate things that save my back and save my knees. So keep that in mind for people that want to just be efficient and get things done quickly. All right, let's use this. All right, folks, let me show you how easy this thing is to use. This is great. So you can lock it and unlock it to adjust your height. When you want to adjust, real simple, real simple turn. When you're ready to get down to business, you lock it in place, easy to lock into place, and you're good to go. Right away, one thing I noticed was I could stand on top of this thing, okay? And that allows me to use my weight, my chest muscles, my tricep muscles, and allows me to work smarter, not harder. So that's excellent right there. And it's really, really simple. The business end of this, you see, seems sturdy, and it allows you to kind of target exactly where you want to pull from. Pretty cool. It does come with a foldable step. I like that. Save you a little space for storage. Not a big deal but it does have teeth, okay? I think that's good because that will probably allow you to not lose traction. Let's say the, the ground is wet, for example. So I like that. That helps you really put it where you want it and have it stay where you want it, okay? Really simple to use, folks, really simple. Let's say I see there's a little bit of a dandelion over here, what the, might remain of a dandelion. And now let's say I'm foraging, okay? So not just for weeding, foraging. I wanna harvest that food. I wanna make a nice salad do something with the root, whatever. I go right on top of it, I step on it, use my body weight, I barely even really did anything there, and I pull in the direction of that step. Boom, I'm not even stepping on it. I can stand on that if I really need to, if the roots are dense, if they're really deep, whatever, I can step on that. I didn't even put my weight on it, I just did that. And then whatever it will pull out, you can eject by just moving this here, okay? That will help get rid of whatever. I can do this all from standing, I did not bend at all. Let's try it again. Let's say I wanna come over here, boom, pull in that direction, and then whatever I wanna get rid of, I eject, okay? Really, really simple. And you can get a rhythm going with this. I can see myself like on a chain gang, boom, how you doing? Pulling, weeding, removing, just making it happen. One after another, stepping, pulling, making it happen. And you see folks, I mean, it really does get down there. It's really simple. And again, to get rid of it, just a little push, that's it. Okay, not working hard, I'm standing upright. This is great. So, you know the deal, I keep it real. Overall, I'd say a great product. Definitely something to consider. Anytime you can make life easy for yourself, when it comes to gardening, raising livestock, homesteading, in general, is great. This will definitely prevent injuries, okay? You don't wanna be stressing your lower back and your knees, so I like that about it. Seems to be well made, it seems to be sturdy. I mean, I'm kinda rough with things, as you can see, and it seems to be Pretty sturdy. Time will tell as far as that goes. Overall, I'd say Deer For Me, you hit another home run. What I will say is Deer For Me products so far are very easy to put together. This was still very easy to put together. I do believe we, my wife and I are blessed with two sons. I believe our six-year-old could put this together just like the other Deer For Me products. However, he might need a little help with this one. So the other products, I would say 9.5 to 10 as far as ease to put together. This, I would say solid nine as far as putting it together. As far as usefulness, I would say I'd give this a 9.1. I think it's definitely useful. It can grab pretty much whatever you want it to grab. Um, and it's, it's just great as far as your back and as far as your knees, okay? As far as cool factor and just having something fun to use and just get things done with, I'd say a 9.4. I'd say a 9.4 because things like this might not be um, what you typically think of. And therefore, I think this is really a great gift option. This is definitely something to give to people um, to make life easier for them. I think it's a great product. Dear for me, you're really doing a great job with uh, making products that are easy to put together, useful, and totally have a cool factor, a fun factor. So I like it. I really think it's great. I will definitely put a link in the description for you folks to help you out and make this easy for you to get. 
and let them know that Triple H sent you. Let them know that we recommend this to you folks and let me know, have you used this product before? If you have not, let me know. Are you interested in picking one up? Okay, like, comment, subscribe if you have not already because you folks are gonna get the real deal reviews all the time. All right, take care everybody.